Hello again guys, this is Vex and for today's video we will uh, I will give you a tutorial how to fix uh, the issue with Division 2 wherein uh, it crashes all the time when you change the video or the game render to DX12 alright uh, for DX11 it's fine but for most uh, players if you choose DX11 uh, you might experience a lot of uh, stuttering on the game and also um, it's not gonna give you much uh, FPS as well so the game feels kinda laggy most of the time but if you change it to DX12 it will improve the gaming experience uh, significantly so Ubisoft has answered to that one and they said that the fix to that is to increase the page file of your hard drives or to where it's installed so to do that we just need to click or uh, right click on your computer all right uh, your, my computer and then advance okay you click on advance and then you go to settings and then you go to advance again advanced tab and then you click on change a virtual memory change button okay there you can just click on C this is I just put it on 10,000 gigabits or 10,000 gigs and then the maximum minimum is 10,000 and maximum is uh, 40,000 <coughs> and then you click on set I also did it on my uh, D drive and E drive as well 10,000 50,000 just to be on the safe side all right that's um, those are the settings that I did and uh, usually before on DX12 I can only play the game like one about 10 or 15 minutes and it will crash but this time yeah I played for three or four hours and um, it never did crash at all so it might be a permanent fix but uh, next time when I have a lot of time I will try to play the whole day to see what it does but for me I played like three or four hours straight and uh, never did have any crash at all uh, so you know it, it really um, it's really a relief that Ubisoft released uh, a fix already for the issue it's been a quite a long time so yeah, that's it and also one other fix for that is um, you know you can if that doesn't work uh, this could also uh, increase your FPS so you just right click on the division icon or if you don't see a compatibility tab here you need to go to the drive where uh, the division 2 is installed so you just need to go to uh, uh, me I installed it on local C drive and then I go to PC games and division 2 Tom, Tom Clancy folder and then there are three division 2 icons here I just what I did I'm not quite sure which one is I think the division 2.exe is the one that is the launcher so I just click on properties and click on compatibility tab and then click on disable full screen optimizations and then change DPI settings and then I click on override DPI uh, scaling behavior and then select application and then click on OK and I did it on uh, all three icons the same procedure properties compatibility tab disable full screen optimizations and then change DPI settings and override high DPI scaling behavior and then select an application you can do this on all of your games uh, it's really gonna boost up your FPS and it's gonna reduce lag as well so I did it on all of my games and um, also if that doesn't fix your issue with the if your game still crashes you can um, uh, limit your frames to 60 uh, on the game itself all right on the division 2 game you can limit it on uh, 60 frames per second all right and uh, um, yeah 60 uh, yeah 60 FPS um, that might be the last resort Right then, uh, but yeah, uh, I think increasing the page file would would fix the issue. All right, that's gonna that's gonna fix the division two uh, crash issue. So you can try it, guys, and uh, leave your comments below. If uh, in case it doesn't work still, I can try to do some workarounds with it, and I can 
I'll keep you posted. Alright, so thank you. Uh, please subscribe if you like this video. Thank you. Bye-bye.